Okay, so what's up guys, welcome back to yet another video. Few days back, we made a video on one of the best custom ROM for OnePlus 5 and 5T. Today, we have the same custom ROM now available for OnePlus 7T series and OnePlus 7 series. So here I have my OnePlus 7 Pro on which I have installed this custom ROM and trust me guys, it gives the best experience of Android 12 on OnePlus 7 Pro. So in this video, let's take a quick look on this ROM and we'll let you know guys whether it can be used as daily driver or not. Before starting the video, thank you so much guys for completing the like target of 400 likes on our previous video. Let's keep the same like target and we have 80% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel. So it's a humble request, do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. I was about to shoot this video yesterday but then we got a new update of this custom ROM. So I thought let's update it to the latest version and then do a quick review. So first let me show you the software information by going to about section and here you can see ROM is Dovefest based on Android 12 which comes with the security patch of 5th December 2021. These are the benchmark results. These were on the previous update and after the update here we have the results. So with the latest update single core have scored 756 and multi core have scored 2734. With N22 benchmark application device has scored 5,87,302. Few days back, we also did a review of Pixel Experience ROM based on Android 12 for OnePlus 7 series, but that had few minor bugs here and there. But as said, I've used this custom ROM on my OnePlus 5 and now I've installed it on my OnePlus 7 Pro. Till now, I haven't faced any kind of issues yet. People who are worried about the payment applications, so you guys don't have to worry about it. In the Play Store, you can see it says device is certified and also this DevFest custom ROM passes the safety net check. All the basic functionalities works pretty fine. As you can see here, I am using my Geo SIM card and no issues while making calls. Also Wi-Fi calling and Volte services works. Bluetooth doesn't have any kind of issues. Alert slider does its job pretty well. Talking about the launcher on this ROM, so we have pre-installed Dovefest launcher and launcher itself comes with many customization options as you can see here. By default, we get to see this AOSP camera pre-installed but I'll leave the Google camera APK in the description below and you can use this particular APK. And this Google camera APK doesn't have any kind of issues. The pop-up camera mechanism do work fine. Sometimes camera app might get crash when you switch to back camera, but that doesn't happen always. Till now, no issues to be seen while using both the bands of Wi-Fi. Screen recording also have few additional options where you can limit the bigger size files and you can also enable lower quality for smaller file size. And guys, if you wish to install this custom ROM on your OnePlus 7 series, I'll leave a video guide in the description below of Pixel Experience ROM. You just have to follow the same guide. If you guys still have any kind of questions, you can ping me on the Telegram group. So as you can see here, under network connections, we have the support of Volte and Wi-Fi calling. Auto brightness is pretty well calibrated on Dirtfest ROM. And another good thing about this custom room is we also get few customization options. So under settings here you can see derp space where you can customize a lot of many things. We also have the option of edge lightning and that works pretty well on my OnePlus 7 Pro. Then you can also enable flashlight for incoming calls. And few other customizations are also there like you can also customize the dark theme. So under this we have two options. One is normal dark theme. So once we enable this we have this grayish background but if you want to have pure black background you can just enable the second option and that's a quite nice add-on on this custom room by default we get to see many icon packs pre-installed for example we also have icon pack from oxygen os and on Dovefest ROM, you also get to see this Monet custom color option. So if you don't want the wallpaper based theming engine, you can just enable this part and add a custom color hex code. Later, we also get to see this burn in protection. And the best part is we also get to see stock OnePlus settings, like where you can customize the alert slider. You have the option to change the vibrator strength. And we also have the touchscreen gestures. Fingerprint unlock is pretty fast. No issues to be seen while unlocking the device. If your device have the support of 90Hz refresh rate, then you get these settings in the display section. And another good thing about this custom room is I can play Battlegrounds Mobile India in 90fps, which is not officially supported by OnePlus on Oxygen OS. Let me go to the settings, graphics, and here you can see the lobby graphics I've set to smooth in 90fps. And here you can see device is giving me 90fps in Battlegrounds Mobile India. Though I'll be doing a dedicated gaming test and the video should be live by tomorrow. One thing which I liked on this custom ROM, which is way better than the stock OS present on OnePlus 7 series and that's haptic feedback. And trust me guys, you'll notice a huge difference in the haptic feedback compared to Oxygen OS. 
and I really like the haptic feedback on the first room. And soon I'll also be doing a complete review of this custom room. I know last time I promised complete review of Pixel Experience room, but that is also in the to-do list. By tomorrow I'll finish the Oxygen OS 12 stable review, and after that you guys gonna see a review on the first room. So if you guys have any specific topic to be covered on this custom room, do let me know in the comment section below. So guys, this was a quick look on one of my favorite room, which is the first room based on Android 12. If you guys have any questions regarding this custom room, you can let me know in the comment section below. As of now, only this much in this video. I hope you guys like the video. If you like the video, then do give me a thumbs up. And also, if you're new to our channel, then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.